So today we're going to be configuring the, the Smappy Home Energy Monitor with SmartThings. Uh, before we get started on the configuration through the SmartThings app, we're going to need to make sure that the Smappy is online and has been set up through the native app and added to your local network. Uh, so once that's been uh, once that's been done, uh, open up the SmartThings app, and uh, from the main menu uh, dashboard, you want to hit Marketplace <coughs> under Things. You want to scroll down to energy monitors you want to choose the smappy energy monitor uk and you're going to want to say connect now so uh, this is a cloud to cloud integration so we're going to need uh, communication between the smappy application and the smart things application so you're going to want to enter your smappy credentials from the smart things app so we tap on that open up a page for you to connect to login so <clears throat> Uh, any of the so this is basically the location that's been created when you set up the Smappy uh, for the first time on the native app. Uh, you can change that around um, from the native Smappy app. Uh, so this is the location that we had created, and we're going to want to say accept. Give that a second to confirm. Should be done just now. There we go. So Smappy account is now connected to Smart Things. Say done. So. Now that that link is established, the next thing we're going to want to do here is uh, actually add the uh, Smappy device itself to the Smappy Connect Smart App. So this is basically our Smappy meter and our in our home location. So you want to say done and done again. There we go. So we've successfully added the Smappy Connect Smart App. So now it's confirmed that the device itself has been added. Uh, we want to go my home. We're going to say things, and there is the uh, Smappy meter. So there's obviously no reading showing right now because there's no magnetic clip. Uh, the magnetic ring has not been uh, clipped onto any uh, cables uh, coming in from a fuse box or anything like that. So we're not going to see any readings for the time being. Um, <clears throat> just one uh, one point of advice: it can be uh, it can take a bit of time for the uh, meter readings to start showing up for the energy readings to start showing up once you connect the uh, the Smappy ring to uh, to a wire going through your fuse box or a cable into your fuse box. So you just be a bit patient when first setting it up. Uh, on a final note, if you were to uh, from my home now, if you were to take the plus arrow from there and hit new thing, you can see here under not yet configured we've got the Smappy uh, meter home uh, the Smappy device. So here you can change the name uh, to whatever you want to call it. So I'm just going to leave it as Smappy Meter Home for the time being. And here you can configure any uh, smart apps uh, such as Energy Alerts if you're using too much energy or Energy Saver if, you, if you're using too much energy and you want some uh, device turned off that's maybe using too much energy. Um, so if you're done, that'll, configure, that'll complete the configuration. And uh, that is the Smappy SmartThings setup.